Your health and wellness are essential, but some body modifications need your attention. Nobody interacts with you by sending out caution indicators of disease. That's why it is vital to focus when it concerns any type of changes in the shape as well as the color of nails, thinning of eyebrows, loss of hair, or unintended fat burning. Also, restroom routine adjustments can indicate a major health issue. In this video, I'm going to show with you 17 body changes that need your attention. If you're new here, I'm sure it'll benefit you so much if you subscribe to our channel for more awesome videos like this. If you or court to suffer from consistent dry split lips, dry skin, peeling skin, or various other annoying skin conditions, you should see a doctor, as these signs and symptoms can likewise have extra serious underlying causes. 1. Dry or cracked lips Flaking dry skin is a close sign of an allergy. In this case, pay close attention to the cosmetics that you use as well as oral hygiene products, foods that you eat, and even medicines. Cracks in the corners of the mouth indicate a lack of vitamin B, A, and E. If you also have dry eyes, a dry mouth, and problems with your digestive system, you'd better visit a doctor because it can be a combination of symptoms specific for an autoimmune disease called Sjogren's Syndrome. 2. Eyebrow loss Not only are thick brows a current trend, but they're also a big health indicator. Periodical loss of eyebrow hair is quite normal, but if you notice an excessive loss of hair as well as the appearance of bald spots or even complete disappearance of your eyebrows, contact a doctor immediately. It can be connected to an excessive or insufficient level of thyroid activity. 3. Nail dystrophy We're all aware of how healthy nails can look. Any change in color or structure is an alarming signal. Thin and pale nails can be a sign of anemia and lack of iron in the body, while yellowing can indicate liver and gastric tract disorders or fungal infection. White spots and stripes indicate a lack of zinc, copper, and iodine, and the nails can become very brittle when faced with lack of vitamins, calcium, iron, and beta carotene in the body. 4. Pale lips with a bright contour There are different explanations for various illnesses if the red borders of the lower lip become swollen and there are small bubbles that appear on it. You are likely very sensitive to ultraviolet rays. What you can do in this situation is to decrease your exposure to the sun with the help of sunscreen cosmetics. Does the middle part of the lip have the same symptom? That's vegetative neurosis. Taking sedatives will become an important part of treating along with anti-inflammatory ointments. Severe swelling and redness of the entire lip indicate an allergic reaction. Pay more attention to your cosmetic and toothpaste and visit an allergologist. 5. Red face If we exclude natural physiological changes such as changes in temperature, massage or alcohol consumption, there are three widespread reasons for getting a red face for women after 40. It's due to a decrease in hormone levels indicating the beginning of menopause. A red face can also indicate the presence of infections that cause demodicosis. A partial redness that goes together with sudden attack of dizziness can signify pressure fluctuations that can be normalized with the help of special medicines. 6. Dry heels The skin on the feet gets dry due to lack of vitamins A and E. It can also be caused by the presence of fungal infections that affects the overall condition of the epidermis. The last case usually goes together with numerous cracks and the yellowing of nail plates. If dryness and roughness don't disappear even with proper care and adequate intake of vitamins, this may be a sign of endocrine disruption. 7. Dry hands and dry skin on the body Dry skin is the norm during colder seasons, but using a moisturizing cream, consuming plenty of water, and taking vitamins are quite helpful. If the solutions mentioned above don't help you, you'd better visit a dermatologist because dry skin is one of the common signs of diabetes and hypothyroidism. If your skin isn't just rough and peeling, but also tight and full of cracks, it may turn out to be dermatitis caused by a natural reaction to chemical exposure. 8. Food Deformity The displacement of a food bent inward and the change in the shape of the food, which is characterized by the omission and the longitudinal or transverse arches, usually indicate flat foot. According to statistics, transverse flat foot combined with other deformations occurs more than longitudinal flat foot and women are more vulnerable to it. The reason for this is due to wearing high heels causing an uneven load distribution to take place, putting the biggest load on the area of the transverse arc. When this arc is unable to stand such load, the foot gets unpleasant, painful pulling sensations, indicating the beginning of a deformation. 9. White stains and teeth Dentofluorosis is a chronic disease that develops either before teething or after, 
when consuming large amounts of water or products with high content of fluorine compounds. There are five types of fluorosis classification. Questionable, very mild, mild, moderate, and severe. The first three variants manifest visually through the appearance of stains, like in the photo above, while the last two lead to decaying teeth issues and teeth crumbling. 10. Hair loss. On average, a person sheds about 100 hairs per day, all because her hair follicles go through certain growth stages that can last from 2 to 8 years. When the growth stage is over, the hair strand falls out and the new one starts to grow after a two-month rest. This means that at one point in time, 80 to 90% of a person's hair is growing, while the rest of it is shedding or is in a resting phase. However, if you have noticed a more significant hair loss, you'd better consult a doctor because there are a bunch of diseases that can be hiding behind this symptom. Those can consist of skin infections, thyroid disorders, autoimmune disorders, etc. As you might have noticed, each of these symptoms separately is not a reason for big worry or a serious diagnosis. It's important to assess your condition objectively and pay attention to additional changes in appearance and well-being. The main thing to remember is that you're better off not neglecting visiting specialists because it's only them who can give an exact answer to your question and make an adequate treatment plan. 11. Your gums. As you age, your gums will probably recede a little. This is true even if they're healthy. But if you've noticed rapidly receding gums, pay attention. When it happens quickly, it's not normal. Maybe you just tore your gums from brushing too hard or in the wrong direction. This happened to me in my 20s and torn gums don't grow back. Becoming aware of the problem helped me learn to make changes that allow me to protect my gum health now. Often, receding gums are a sign of gum disease, which is the leading cause of tooth loss in adults worldwide. If you have receding gums, it could be an indication of an advanced stage of gum disease called periodontal disease. This is when the bone around the tooth starts to disintegrate. Obviously, this is something you don't want to ignore. So, be sure to see your dentist as soon as you can. That way, you'll get the necessary treatment to keep your smile beautiful for years to come. 12. Your moles. If you have one or more moles, you want to pay attention to them and make sure to bring any small changes to your dermatologist's attention. They could be nothing, but melanoma is fast-growing skin cancer. So, you want to catch it in its early stages when it's easily treatable. Make a date to check your skin for moles and any other skin changes every month. You may even want to measure your moles or take pictures so you can use this information for reference if there are any changes. And see your dermatologist once a year for a complete skin check by a professional. 13. Your nails. Did you know that the changes in your toenails and fingernails can be serious indications? That's why it's important to look out for these bodily changes because while it is rare, it can be very serious. So, early detection is key. Melanoma, skin cancer of the nail, can look extremely similar to a black and blue bruise. So many people have no clue that they have it until it has spread. So if you have a new bruise on your nail and you don't remember injuring yourself, you need to pay attention. Watch the bruise area for about a month. And if the bruise doesn't look like it's starting to grow out with a nail, toenails especially grow very slowly. It's time to see a doctor. Most often, this will be a bruise. Nail melanoma is a less common disease, but if you do have it, you want to catch it fast. 14. Your ears. If you're like me, you associate hearing loss with aging, but there are reasons even a younger person can experience hearing loss, so it's important to fully understand and identify the problem. There are several reasons why you might experience hearing loss. Maybe you have an ear infection, leading to temporary hearing loss, or maybe you have damage to the inner ears bones, which can lead to permanent problems, or perhaps you've developed tinnitus from years of loud music in concerts. In any case, you should go to your doctor or a hearing specialist as soon as possible. And that way, if they do identify a problem, they can slow any further hearing loss and give you something to help like PSAPs that can drastically improve your quality of life. 15. Your breasts. Of course, you know a breast lump can be a problem. But did you know that breast cancer doesn't always present as a lump? In fact, there are many other sneaky signals for breast cancer that may show up instead of a breast lump. For instance, you may notice a change in the shape of your breast. Maybe a nipple is pointing in instead of out that didn't do this before. Perhaps you develop a rash in your breast or maybe you're experiencing a skin thickening of the breast tissue. All of this can possibly be signs of breast cancer. So, in the name of being vigilant, pay a visit to your doctor if you notice anything unusual. And in my humble opinion, if the doctor says it's just a cyst or milk duct, 
As for a sonogram anyway, the only way to know what it is for sure is through imaging. 16. Your weight If you haven't been eating differently or exercising to lose weight, then definitely take note of any fluctuations. If you're not changing your diet or exercise, your weight should not be changing more than 10 pounds, especially losing 10 or more pounds, says Griona. Losing significant weight with no lifestyle change is most often associated with various different cancers and something that should not be ignored. 17. Change in your bathroom habits If you used to have a pretty predictable bathroom schedule, pay attention if it suddenly changes, if your bowel movements are not consistent, or you're having trouble with constipation, diarrhea, you may be sick, Griona says. Also, if you constantly are running to the bathroom and having bladder issues, head to your doctor. Discomfort with your bladder and bowel movements are usually strong signs that something else is going on if they last longer than a week.